Well, welcome back, everyone. You know, wearing your seatbelt is the easiest thing you can do to protect yourself in a crash. And here to talk about that is Lieutenant Nick Bose from the Ohio Highway Patrol. Welcome, Nick. Hey, thanks for having me. I appreciate it. Okay, so seatbelt, like we said, it's the easiest thing to do. The old saying, click it or ticket, right? <laughs> no, exactly, man. That should be the first thing you do. As soon as you get in that car, it should be buckle up right away and... Uh, then you're good to go. Yeah. Now, you sent me a statistic, so what I thought was interesting. It said since 2019, a total of 2,919 people who were not wearing an available seatbelt were killed on Ohio's roadways, and that's very unfortunate. That, that is such a high number, and it's, it's something that could be uh, a lot of those people could be alive today if they would have been wearing those seatbelts. So... The goal is to get people convinced, like, hey, we need you to wear them because it could save your life. Right, exactly. And, you know, with the weather that we're, you know, coming around the corner, it's just coming around the corner, the winter weather, you know, that means icy roads, snowy conditions, wind, slush, rain. You know, the roads become a little bit more of a hazard when you're on them. And so... Uh, like you said, the first thing you want to do when you get into a car is, is something that you should probably always do when you first get in a car is just put that seatbelt on, right? It, it's like you said, it's, it's a simple thing to do, and it, it's, it's safe. It could, it could save you. Yeah. Now, what about children? Because, you know, some people might be confused when they have children. It's like, what, what's the, the age, age ranges that are the high laws for age ranges for children wearing a seatbelt or something like that, or a car restraint, uh, a child restraint system? Okay, so how it works is if, if they're four years old or less than 40 pounds, they should be in a regular car seat. Whether it's front facing or rear facing, they need to be in a car seat within those ranges. Now, if they are um, between four and eight years old, then then they still need to be in a booster seat. And I want to say it's if they're also, if they're below four feet, uh, mm -hmm. nine inches. Yeah. Okay, so they want to be in the booster seat. That way the seat belt uh, doesn't uh, ch potentially choke them. Right. If they're involved in a crash. And then if you're... Uh, between 8 and 15 years old, do you have to wear a seat belt no matter where you're at in the vehicle? Oh, okay. So the front, the front seat, back seat, it doesn't matter. Yes, front yeah. seat, back seat, it so, doesn't matter. 8 to 15 years old, you have to wear it. Right. Now, uh, people, you know, these, this, this law came into effect a while back, and so people are kind of used to seeing the signs on the road, click it or ticket, but some people still choose to, you know, just ignore that sign or, you know, ignore the warnings, and I, I'm not sure why that is. It's the first thing I do, Nick, when I get into my car. I put my seatbelt on, it just becomes habit. Well, there, there's a lot of people out there that they say it, it's their right, it's their choice not to, and... And that, that's, that's the reason that's been given to me. Yeah. Um, they said no matter what, no matter the fine, they're not going to wear it. And all I can say is I truly believe that it saves lives. So. Yeah. Uh, so so safety, seatbelt safety compliance has been up. Uh, since 2022, so at least people are starting to to take heed and the importance of seat belts and and how it can save their lives, right? It, it is nice to see that number trend upward. See see that people are starting to wear the seat belts a little more. Yeah. So real quick, Nick. So if you are out there, out and about, you know, just as a reminder for everyone, you know, like I said, it's the easiest thing to do to save your life. But um, first thing you do, just put on the seat belt, make it a habit. Absolutely. First thing you do, put that seatbelt on. And, and I would also add, add to this of always just make sure when you're driving, leave that phone down. We are also seeing an uptick in crashes uh, with, yeah. uh, that involve distracted drivers. I want to say I looked at the numbers for our post um, this week. And so far for the year, we've handled over 1,100 and eight crashes as wow. of yesterday. Wow, that's so, a lot. So, yeah, that's quite a bit for the year. Yeah. Well, Nick, as always, thank you for keeping the highway safe and always coming in here to bring some good reminders to our viewers. So thanks again. Hey, thanks for having me. I appreciate it. All right. Well, don't go away because we have more and we return.